Hey y'all, hey, it's Reese. Welcome back for a quick little video. First, let me say thank you to all of my old subscribers. Welcome to all of my new subscribers. New subscribers, don't forget to hit that notification bell so you will know every single time I what come through with a new video. So today we are going to be talking about no other than my jazzy life, uh, my jazzed up life, yeah. So Jazzy has hit us again with another rip the runway, okay? So she wore, um, it was only two items in this actual haul, if I'm not mistaken, that she did. Um, the first item was like a red, um, like loose spaghetti strap dress. I think it was like red and then had white lines going all around it and then it had pockets to it okay now i don't really know you know what i mean what's been going on with jazzy well actually i do because i've been watching her but what i'm going to say is this is not the normal jazzy all right jazzy has literally been doing her thing for a couple weeks now okay so this little outfit ensemble that she had Oh my gosh, it was really, really, really cute. It was long all the way down to her ankles. And for some reason, I think that red is Jazzy's color. Red looks really, really nice on her. She did another haul back um, a month ago and it was a red dress. And I think red is her color. It looked very, very pretty on her. Okay. See, not to only mention that Jazz... All right, let me tell you. She has been working out, okay? At first, I look, I'm like, I don't even know why she thinks she's working out. She ain't gonna lose no weight. Jazzy has blew the shit out of me, all right? Jazzy has made me look like a complete fool because she is sticking to it and she is not new to it. It seems that she is actually true to this. See, I've been actually watching Jazzy exercise videos, and I'm going to be here, and I'm going to let you know whatever those exercises that Jasmine be doing, where she is sweating her whole entire face out, her neck, I mean, just sweating, just pouring out or whatever. See, that right there is the first thing that I'm not going to be able to do. I mean... I, I, I don't like the sweat. You get what I'm saying? I, I just can't do it. But Jasmine, she can. She can do it. So, I got to get a girl her props. Because if you ask your girl right here to go put on a trash bag. Well, I don't think the thing she wears is a trash bag. But yeah, it looked like a trash bag or whatever. You ask me to go do that. Um, The next thing before I even do it, I'm going to let you know keep your cell phone on you because you are definitely going to have to call the fire department okay yeah the ambulance i'm gonna, I'm gonna need all of that okay because i would have passed out on the floor she is doing her thing not only that but she did a picture the other day And you could clearly see that Jasmine has lost some pounds, okay? And she is running around here putting on these nice little outfits, okay? And I, I kind of don't get it because, you know what I'm saying, Jasmine, she been doing the thing with the outfits. See, what needs to happen is, Jasmine, Chrissy need to take your outfits or whatever, and go ahead and go out in those outfits or do a haul because, yeah, you've been wearing some real cute stuff, okay? Now, you already know I'm going to tell you if it's cute or if it's not. But that red and white dress, oh, yeah, that was real, real cute. I mean, it was. So then, Jasmine, you had the nerve, the audacity to put on. They were like, I guess it was like a peach blush color, it, somewhere around there. And it was the leggings. And then it had a shirt that went with it. But the shirt was like really flowy or whatever. And then Jasmine had the nerve 
let me tell you, she had the nerve to put on like some black sandals or whatever with all the toes out, thong sandals. I had to look at this picture again with her modeling herself inside the hallway with this outfit on. And Jasmine, you have done it yet again. Okay? That outfit was simply cute on you. Okay? The color even fits you well. Also, by you, you losing all of this weight, you seem to be more confident in yourself. And that shines through when you are modeling them clothes. Now, I can't forget that she had some sunglasses as well, and one pair was red. So she put those sunglasses on with the red outfit. And when I had seen these glasses, I was like, mm, they ugly. I don't know why she's going to try to put them on. But, honey, when Jasmine put the glasses on with the dress, the whole ensemble, I said, look at this shit. Won't God do it? You can pray to God, you get what I'm saying, and girl, he will turn it around, all right? He will turn it around. I don't know, Jazzy. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't really know right now what I'm going to do with you, okay? I have not seen your house the way you used to have it. I have not seen you dress your kids the way that you used, you know what I'm saying, to dress them. I have seen you be this different person all way around. And I got to say, I like it. You're doing well. Do you realize in this video that I am making right now, because like I tell you, we don't, I mean, at least I don't. I don't come to bash you. I'm going to just speak on your content. If your content is not good, I'm going to give you my opinion. Because I can do that. I have a fee freedom of speech. That is what reactors do. Mm -hmm, the real ones, you know what I mean? But yeah, I, I mean, that's what it is. Um, like I said this many times before, um, when I get ready to go to certain restaurants or when I am different states and stuff, I go ahead to Yelp and I Google the name of the places that I feel like I am going to go attend. So therefore, I want to see how they are represented. And a lot of times when places are not what you expect them to be, they do what you call a review, as in a reactor. So as in the customer is reacting on the store or on the restaurant and telling you what things they like and what things they just did not like, okay? Sort of also like, you know, when you are at the movies and before you go to the movies, you know, it used to be these two guys. I think they're still there. And they were called Cisco and Ebert. So they would come on and give you their review of the movie. And they would tell you, well, if I was y'all, hmm, I don't think I would go see that movie. I think what you should do is go ahead, sit back, and wait for this one to come out at home. In all reality, what they are saying, because it's a review... They are telling you it's not good enough to go and see. Okay? You can wait for it to come to your home on your TV. All right. So that's just a common sense um, example that I have just told you. Okay? So, you know, before you guys decide to go into my comments and... You know what I mean? Um, leave me these dumb messages. Um, I just want to let you know, please don't do it. Please. Because I don't even read them. I clearly delete them. The first little three words, that's it. I delete it. I can tell by those three words if you are getting ready to come on here and act a complete 
fool. And the only thing that I am going to do is completely delete and maybe block you. Okay? I mean, it is what it is. Y'all already know. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm going to tell you what it is. But, um, yeah. Um, you've been doing really, really, really well, Jasmine. Um, I can't even, you know what I mean? I can't even come on here and speak negative because you have been doing an amazing job. So, with that being said, I just wanted to come on here and tell you about your haul. That it was real, 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 real cute. That's about it. So, until my next video, guys, see you later.